Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In today's video, we will talk about dividing numbers with two-digit divisor. So without further ado, let's do this topic. I'm doing this video because a lot of people are commenting about our previous video na okay daw yung nangyari na kung saan we divided a number using long division with one divisor. And this time, we will level up yung ating video. Here, our divisor is 13, wherein it is a two-digit number. So remember guys, when you're dividing numbers, yung steps natin ay divide, second is multiply, and lastly, we will subtract. Ito lang yung tatlong operations na gagamitin natin ng, with repetition in dividing numbers. So let's have this one. 23,576 divided by 13. So first natin ginagawa dito is we will divide the, one, the first digit 2 by 13. But we know that 13 is greater than 2. So hindi natin, walang, hindi magkakaroon ng 13. So the answer here is 0, guys. If we will divide 2 by 13 because it's impossible na magkaroon ng 13 sa loob ng 2. So after this, since hindi kaya ng 2, we will move to the 2-digit number, which is 23. Again, after 2 divided by 13, which is hindi pwede, we will move with the 2-digit number, which is 23 divided by 13. And the thing here is, you need to estimate, you need to properly estimate your answer here. Okay? We have 23 divided by 13, and there is only one 13 inside 23. Okay? Then, so we, after dividing, we need to multiply. 1 times 13, that is 13. And then after that, we need to, letter C, subtract. 23 minus 13 is equal to how many? 10. Okay? And then after this, we will bring down 5. So right now, this is 105. We will repeat these steps. We need to divide. But this time, we will focus here. 105 divided by 13. So how many 13s do we have inside 105? Other people, uh, nagkumagamit sila ng trial and error. Okay? They're multiplying 13 by a number until makuha nila yung malapit sa 105. And this time, 105 divided by 13 is definitely equal to how many? The answer is 8. We have 8 13s inside 105. So what we need to do, after dividing, we need to multiply. So we have 18, a uh, 8 times 13. So what do you think is the answer? 8 times 10 is 80. And 8 times 3, that is equal to 24. So we have... 104, right? So we have here 104. So after multiplying, we will subtract. So 105 divided by uh, minus 104 is equal to 1. So after this, we will bring down 7. So what we have now is 17 divided by 13. We will start here again. And 17 divided by 13 is definitely equal to 1. Okay? So multiply 1 times 13, that is equal to 13. Then, same thing you need to do. You need to subtract. 17 minus 13 is equal to 4. And then, bring down 6. So what we have here is to divide 46 by 13. We only have 3. Okay? 3 13's inside 46, that's why we have here 3. And 3 times 13, that is 39. Then we will subtract these numbers. So, subtracting this, 6 minus 9 cannot be, we'll borrow, borrow 1 here from 4. It will become 3. So what we have now is 16 minus 9, and that is equal to 7. 
meaning this is your remainder. Other people are writing here, they are writing here R7, meaning that is your remainder. So to finalize our answer, 20,576 divided by 13 is equal to 100, 1,813 and remainder 7. So let's continue with another example for you to familiarize how to divide numbers with two-digit divisors. So what we have here, guys, is 5,148 to be divided by 12. This is a two-digit number. So let's try. Let's try first. 5 divided by 12 cannot be. This is 0. So we will move with the two-digit dividend. 51 divided by 12. So we have 4 12s because 4 times 12 is 48. So that is the nearest one between 50, uh, from 51. So we have here 4. Then after dividing, we need to multiply. Of course, 4 times 12 is 48. And then subtract. So cannot be. We will borrow 1 here. Cancel. Gain 4. This will become 11. So 11 minus 8 is 3. And 4 minus 4 is 0. So what we have here is we will bring down 4. So here, here's your new divisor, divide dia, 34 divided by 12. So if there are 3 12s, that is 36. So lag pa 34. So hindi siya pwede maging 3. So definitely this is 2. Okay? So 2 divided by 12, ah oh, sorry, 2 times 12 is 24. Okay? Next, subtract as our routine. What's next? What is the answer? The answer is 10. And then after this, bring down 8. Now, 108 divided by 12 is... Wait. Um, if I'm, this is 9. Okay? We have 9 12s inside 108. Because... 100, uh, 12 times 10 is 120, I think 120 minus 12, that is 108, so this one is an exact number, so 9 times 12 is definitely 108, okay, subtract this, and you have the remainder of 0, meaning guys, here, when you are dividing 5,148 divided by 12, your quotient is 429. This is the answer, guys. So, I hope, guys, you learned something from this video. And I will give you an example, guys. So, let's have an example here. Wherein, I hope na you could try this example. We have here, um, let's try, 4,811 divided by 17. So, what do you think is the answer here? Okay, this will be your assignment. And I hope guys you learned something from this video. So, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe. But hit the bell button for you to be updated sa ating latest uploads. Again, it's me, Teacher Gon. Marami marami salamat. Bye-bye!